I'm going to show you guys how to turn in homework and how to work on your homework using Google Slides today. So first, of course, you're going to open your Google Classroom through Rapid Identity, of course. And right now we're going to work with Ms. Herrera's assignment. I am going to go to Classwork and I am going to look for the assignment there. And it's gonna, of course, it's always important to read all the instructions that your teacher is posting. Then you open the one that says Google Slides. Make sure that you have your drive installed, Google Drive, and that it's connect, that it's already registered with your account and also your uh, Google Slides. And you can find those in MISD apps. So automatically it saves into your, the slides will save into your drive. Anything that your teacher posts on Google Classroom, it automatically goes to your Google Drive. So here I open, I'm opening the assignment and it's in Google Slides. So the first thing I did was make a copy of it. Once you make the copy, and notice how it says copy on the very top, the copy of that assignment, you work on the assignment itself. Here you have to sort the common nouns and the proper nouns in the right place. So I'm showing you how to do one or two. And of course, you're gonna finish the rest. You're gonna drag all of them to whether they're common nouns or proper nouns to the right column. Then you go to the next one, you double tap on the blanks so that you can type your answers the way that I'm doing uh, for a common noun store. I'm gonna put a proper noun which is the name of the store. And of course, you're gonna fill out all the blanks. Once you finish everything, and I mean all the blanks, then what you're gonna do, you're gonna go back and you are going to rename the assignment. You're gonna remove the part where it says copy and rename, I would put your first name and maybe your first, the first letter of your last name. So uh, I am signing in as a student in here and I'm just, I'm putting the name. Once you finish renaming it, there it is. And once you rename, it's gonna open the assignment with the new name. And this is a copy that has your answer. So you're gonna go to share and export and then send a copy. Once you send a copy, select PDF. So basically you're gonna create a PDF with your answers so that your teacher can grade it. And you're gonna select drive. You want the copy in your drive. And I'm gonna show you why in a bit. It's gonna appear there, hold on. And as you can see, I'm using another student's drive as well so that I can show you this video. So it'll save onto your drive. So now I'm gonna go back to Google Classroom because it's already saved in my drive because I'm gonna turn it in. You haven't turned in your assignment yet. So I'm gonna look for this assignment and make sure that you complete everything. This assignment includes videos. So make sure that you go over all the instructions, step-by-step, step, all the videos. And here I'm gonna go to add or create. I'm gonna go to drive because that's where I saved it. And it's gonna be the most recent one that is the PDF. So you're gonna click it, make sure that it has the name and that that is the assignment that you wanna turn in. Once it's highlighted, you put add. And notice how this assignment has other parts that you still have to do. So once you do all the assignments, all the videos, then at the end, you have to select turn in. Because if you don't put turn in, your teacher is not going to know that you turned in the assignment. So that is super duper important, boys and girls. Turn it in. Entreguen su trabajo. And that concludes the video today. Till next time, be safe. See you soon.